Welcome to Guns and Chicken Strips. I'm your host James. What's happening? Do you ever watch movies and you just get that tear in your eye? It's, and you're just like, yeah, yes. Movies that get me are he the movies with heroism. Like Saving Private Ryan, all those rocket and war movies like that, stuff like that. Self-sacrifice, those movies get me. For example, the movie Battleship. I'd never seen it, got horrible reviews, just everybody said it was a bad movie. But I watched it this morning and I'm not a big alien type movie fan, not at all. That was a pretty good movie. The heroism in it was on point and rocking. What got me was Liam Neeson in the end when he said, <laughs> when the main character asked him for his daughter's hand in marriage and he said, no, and now I think I'll go for a chicken burrito. That cracked me up, I'm not gonna lie. I laughed pretty dang hard at that movie. What movies get you like that, you know? Like me, movies like heroism. Movies with heroism and I'm like Independence Day when the dude flew the jet up into the into the gun shaft and blew it up and he said, I'm coming home or whatever he said. That gets me. grabs me by the guts, I get goosebumps, and I'm up ready to fight. I'm up ready to just rise up and just, oh, bad dudes. Awesomeness. I just love that. Heroism grabs me by the cojones, you know what I'm saying? Gets gets that tear in my eye going, wanting to fight, wanting to save people. But anyway, I just wanted to, something was on my mind this morning when I woke up, so I wanted to touch base with, with my fellow my fellow human beings out there. Today, we've got three missions. One of them was obvious. The second mission, I've been saving up money for a while to do this. I finally have enough money to do it. Finally have enough money to do what I've been planning on doing. And I'm not really good at saving money. And this is a goal that I reached, a personal goal to save up enough money to get to this item. And to most YouTubers and people, I guess, you know, it's not that much money. Saving up that much money for me is, you know, I usually blow my money way too fast. So this is a milestone for me. I'm getting good. I'm learning people. I'm making moves in life. I'm becoming a better person. Every day I'm working on being a better person and this is just one step that proves I'm getting that much closer. So let's get out there and start our day. Mission number one. Lunch. Deli sandwich. on to number two and that mission ladies and gentlemen was what I was talking to you about earlier something I had been saving up for that I've really needed got tired of using lunkers it is a GoPro finally saved up enough money to buy a GoPro which one am I gonna get you might ask lunkers has urged me to get the GoPro Hero 4 not the 5 because he says the sound quality on the 5 is horrible. It's got awesome video. I'm not sure which one yet. I'm thinking probably 4 because I got mics and stuff coming that I can plug into it. But I don't know. We'll see when I get there. Best Buy does not let us film in there. We've been kicked out of many of them. So see you when I get out. I went against Mr. Turkla's advice and I went with the Hero 5 Black just because I just wanted the newest thing. I don't know why. You know what this means, right? This means all kinds of new footage. I got all kinds of ideas now. 
I got rifle mounts. I got all kinds of stuff coming for all the shooting we're going to be doing. I'm pretty dang excited. I got dual battery chargers, GoPro extra batteries. This is going to be rocking, guys. This is going to be my favorite part. I got Rocco and Musa harness. It's going to be Musa and Rocco vision. See what I'm saying? This is going to be awesome. I've never had one before. This is my first one. GoPro action. If you all, if you see all the GoPros in my other videos, I always use Mr. Turkless. And he was trying to sell me one, but I just I didn't want to owe him money. So I went out and bought my own. And the reason why it took me so long is because I wanted to save up and be able to get everything I wanted with it. But one shot, boom. Yeah, and it was cost a pretty penny to get all this stuff. It took me a while to save up. I'm hoping it's worth it. I know it's going to be bad to the bone, the shots I'm going to get. I mean, I got I got Picatinny rail mounts coming. Ooh, it's going to be awesome. I'm going to start spending every weekend down at the ranch making shooting videos. Pretty pumped about it. This this spring and summer is going to be it's going to be good. Got lots of ideas coming up. We just got to make it through this this winter no bueno action can't wait to get out there and just go crazy well anyway got my gopro stuff lots of great stuff coming with that got a lot of good ideas and on top of that i know you know i'm from the great state of texas and to commemorate the cowboys win or loss tomorrow well today you're gonna be seeing this on the day the cowboys play the packers their first playoff game this year I'm going to be doing a giveaway. I'm going to be doing a giveaway for this Daryl Johnston signed picture. See? If you don't know who Daryl Johnston is, he's Moose. One of my favorite players. Signed. I had the certificate for it, but I lost it, so it's definitely real. I'll be doing a giveaway with this. Just leave a comment, any comment, and I'll be randomly selecting that comment tomorrow evening. Any comment randomly selected will win this Daryl Johnson, aka Moose, signed picture to commemorate the Cowboys' loss or victory. I don't care. I just love the Cowboys. I know this episode was short, but it was a beautiful episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Got me a GoPro now, all hooked up. It's going to be a sweet year, ladies and gentlemen out there. And Guns and Chicken Strip Land. Every one of you guys is awesome. Stay positive. I hope you enjoyed today's episode. Appreciate each and every one of y'all, like always. Hug your family, and as always, we'll see you tomorrow.